So, my name is Eline Konijn. I am from the Netherlands and I'm working here as a young graduate trainee at ESSEC. The young graduate traineeship is a program offered by ESA. It's a one-year program and it gives the opportunity to recently graduated students to get experience in the space industry. You have on one hand the science, but this also sometimes to get results for your science, to do observations, you need instruments for this. And these instruments are normally developed and make, made by engineers. So the engineers are between the world and the scientists. So without scientists, we engineers will not have a job, but without engineers, the scientists could not do their work. I would love to continue to develop myself as an engineer to gain more technical knowledge. Uh, and then later on, I have done many various activities in organizing things as well when I was a student. I love to do this as well. So maybe later on, if I become more an expert in my field, take more responsibilities, who knows then, either I have to see at that point if I go management, or maybe still say as an engineer, but that's, that's still something to be determined. I'm not certain yet at the moment. As a child, well, I have very fond memories of building with Lego with my dad. So we were like, uh, with the two of us, uh, building technical Lego, building various things. Like I remember one time a fire truck we building up. Um, and I, I really enjoyed doing this. I was always very curious. I'm still very curious. I was also always asking why is it working like this? Uh, how is it working? Uh, like really analyzing things, like disassembling things and see how it's working. I have to say, personally, I'm dyslectic, meaning that I have issues with like languages. Um, so initially, uh, studying and uh, working in English was a bit of a, a challenge, but uh, I think by pushing, by really working hard on this, I try to overcome this. And I think at the moment it's been my biggest setback. But yeah, although it can also be actually instead of seeing it as a handicap, it can also be an opportunity to deal with like if you have challenges or so if there's another challenge coming up I know how to deal with this. So. What I noticed that in my surroundings that indeed there are less women than men. Um, I think it's not because women are worse in the same courses or like in engineering or science. I think what also what at least what I noticed is that as a teenager I was and I think that girls have this more than boys, is that we are more thinking about, oh, I'm not sure if I can do this. So my advice to uh, some of the girls who'd like to do uh, engineering or science is that don't be afraid that it's be too difficult. Just try it, um, because it can be very rewarding. And um, if you don't try, you never know. And then you will always wonder maybe later on that you miss an opportunity. So just go for it and don't be afraid that you cannot do it.